Welcome to Excel Magic Trick number 304. Hey, if you want to download this workbook and follow along, click on my YouTube channel, then click on my college website link, and you can download this workbook, Excel Magic Trick 302 to 306. Hey, I have a quick little video here. I just have done a lot of frequency tables in my videos and in my statistics. Uh, and here's some classes or categories. We had some machines to build, and so we timed them. We did a sample, and then we categorized them, three up to six minutes, six up to nine minutes. Here's the count or the frequency, and here's the percent. I just want to show you how to put these both on one chart. Highlight, category, and then our two data series. And in uh, 2003, you have to go up to the charts wizard and add a column chart. In 2007, there's a keyboard shortcut for the default chart, which I have set up as column. So I Alt F1, Alt F1. And then I'm going to change the size a little bit. Uh, that's not what I wanted. Then I'm going to click on the uh, data series for the percentage and use Control-1. That opens the format data series. I'm going to say secondary axis immediately. You can see that it's added it there. I, I don't do not want the color for that one to show up. So I'm going to say fill, no fill. Click close, and there we have it. I'd like to add a couple labels too. I'm going to click here and delete. Uh, this is probably obvious, but I'll show you that you, you know, if we put a label here, this one's obvious because of percent. But let me show you how to put labels on both of them. I'm going to go to chart tools layout. And under axis titles, there's a primary and secondary now. I'm going to say secondary vertical axis right there. And I'm actually going to link this to the cell. The way you link a label is to hit F2. Notice up here your cursor's flashing. Equals, and then I'm going to click on percent, enter. Now I'm going to go back up to layout, axis titles, and primary vertical one right here. F2 equals frequency, enter. And finally, I'll add one down here also, uh, the x-axis. So I'll go up to Layout. And then Horizontal, I'll put the secondary one. Where is Horizontal? Oh, there's the primary Horizontal, right down at the bottom. And I'll say F2 equals, and I'll click on this one, Minutes to Assemble Machine. So just like that. Hey, one other thing. Since these are classes and they're connected, this is 3 up to but not including 6, and this is 6 up to 9, you always want to show the columns as no gap. Control-1 and no gap. Um, how about Control-1 and some border color right there? I'm going to say solid line, black, and that's OK. All right, so that's just uh, how to add uh, a secondary axis. All right, we'll see you next trick.